how bad that would be if I just, if the second attempt didn't work and I just left. Oh, that would have been bad. More ruins. Uh, take this out. Whoa. Whoa. Uh-oh. I do not like this. I'm gonna be surrounded. Okay. Or? Nope. Oh. Okay. Well, at least I can do this. Although bombs really seem like the optimal way of doing it, considering there's so much area. Okay, so we have a little bit of mining. And I'm guessing we're looking for like a switch? This is like a passage, oh my word. Oh, this is, this is insane. Listen, listen close. Do you hear that? There is something this way. Found it! I found something. Whoa! That's not what I was expecting. I was expecting a bubble frog. Okay. Let's not die. Let's not die. And run into the room. Ow, 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 that hurt a lot, that hurt a lot. Uh, I need a reach weapon. Okay, good, good, good. Kill him. Get him. Okay. There's more above, that's... Oh, but we get the statues. The statues are gonna kinda tell us what what's up here. Can I get like 30 bombs, please? Another shield. Drop. Uh, drop. I'm just stacking up shields. Like, why not? Why not, right? Get another. Okay, so the statues are pointing in a specific direction. So I guess I should follow them. I'm. I didn't. I wasn't aware that I was playing Minecraft. <laughs> I was gonna mention it the other episode, uh, where I found the, the first cave, but... Are we not just playing Minecraft now? Does attack power matter here? Yes, it does. Okay. We are on the right track. Oh, 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 progress. Wow. Oh, wait, hold up. Okay, I thought that was ore. We are making progress. We are behind a wall. Oh, 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 oh. Gonna sneak. There's a chest. And a lizard. Ah, the reward is the lizard! I didn't get the reward. What is in this chest? It had better be good. The Von Porus Divine Helm? The, the Amiibo Helm? Okay. Okay! That's a good reward. Does that break all of them? Please say yes. No. 
Okay. But here's the thing. I have a feeling that there's a bubble frog in here. Um, I hate to say it, but I think that makes sense. Like, there's an entire left path that we did not go, so I need to do a little bit more mining. <sighs> Smash cut. I hear it. There is definitely a bubble frog. Got him. Oh, I almost got him. Okay. Well, I was right. And again, th there's nothing worse in an open world game than having to backtrack for important resources. So, getting this, ooh, hoo, 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 getting this it now is is very important. So, that I I'm gonna guess that's it for this this mini dungeon. Like, that's, that's all the resources I'm guessing are here. Like, I have this pretty well cross-sectioned, and there might be, like, a chest with something in it, but I've gotten a diamond, a bubble frog, and a, ch a divine beast helm. Which, now that I'm thinking of it, is, like, the first reference we've seen of the divine beast. I'm content. Let's get out of here. I am very content with that. Uh, and that's not all, though. I do still want to go into... Uh, sand shoes. That's fine. I do still want to go into the maze. Like, I want to do that this recording session. But first... There's- there are a couple things around here I want to- I want to see. Got him. Silver rupee? Yeah! We're getting so many rewards. It's actually kind of ridiculous. <laughs> oh! I thought you were a Mulduga. I don't have any arrows. Uh. Oh, but there's rewards. Killing him is really important. Got him. Yeah, that's that's what I came here to get. So I can I can peace out from here. And they don't know I'm here somehow. <laughs> Doing it again. Okay, this is just our hint. This is just our hint to go to the the Shrine of the Silver Monkey. So I'm gonna grab these melons, boom boom, and we're gonna warp out. We are going to Gerudo Town, actually. First off, I definitely have enough money now to buy whatever I want. Hey, yo, buy stuff. Buy four of my sapphires, buy four of my topaz, yes. I'm gonna buy the snow boots. We're gonna need him eventually. And then... I'm gonna buy the spo- Uh, I can just barely not afford it. I can definitely get both of those, so I'm gonna grab the trousers. Do I need the trousers? Man, I don't think I need the trousers. Yeah, I don't need the trousers. Yep. Yep, gonna buy this too. <sighs> we are, we now have all the clothes we need for I mean for a while. Good. I can handle the heat now. And I'm going to use that to go to the maze. Beautiful Kidowak Shrine. I have no recollection of getting this one. It's maze time. I... Mazes have always been... I'm going the wrong direction. I forgot to cook. I forgot... That's part of the reason why I was going to Gerudo Town. Well, 
I could just go go back, but no, let's see how far we can survive. Let's just be careful for a change, since I'm not very careful. What is this? What? What is this? What? Do I need to, like, fuse this? No. What is... What is this? Like, clearly it's a Korok seed. But I don't know how to get it. No. Wait, I got it. I think. We basically gotta, like, use some weight. And throw this over the side so it uncorks it. <laughs> yep. That's that's how you do it. That's that's neat. I like that. That is character. So yeah, I don't have any food. Um that might come back to bite me, because I literally have I have one meal to my name. I'm really bad about that in this game for some reason. Uh I don't need another fire rod. Although maybe I nah nah. I'm good. I'm good. I don't need one. Okay. Mazes were quite the spectacle in Breath of the Wild. And this this is one we've done before technically. That doesn't mean I'm gonna remember the layout, but I do know what to look for. South Lome Labyrinth. And there is Blight. Research log, day one. According to Taro, the characters carved into the stone slab read as follows. The, dragon's ri the dragon ring slumbers in the labyrinth's depths. Wake it, and ye shall re receive due compensation. Now that Taru's gone off to examine the other ruins, I have no choice but to tough out the rest of this research alone. I'll leave a trail of acorns and nuts behind so I don't get lost. Okay. Why are there fronds? Why did that spawn in front of me? Uh, I wish there was a pot. But there's not. Let's go ahead and equip my Tunic of the Depths. Going to be very useful. Hopefully there won't be... Oh, that's why there are fronds. Ah, that all too familiar, wonderful music. I This is my favorite track in... um. This is my favorite track from Breath, Breath of the Wild. It's so evocative. And yes, I know I can take the trail of acorns. We're gonna do- we have to explore this entire thing anyway. It only makes sense that I... I start from the edges. Stairs. Oh, it's all coming back. It's all coming back. This... I'm not gonna say this part of the maze took me- or this maze took me a long time. I think it took me a reasonable amount of time, but... I mean, it's a maze. There's there's a lot to this. And looking up is very important. There is a specific segment, if it's anything like Breath of the Wild, which it already is, uh, where you have to... Like, there's an opening up in the air. But given this game's, uh, I guess, tenet of verticality, and the fact that I could just instantly go to the top, that's going to be very useful. Uh-oh. My food is, yeah, it is gloom, it's gloom resistance too. I think I eat that now. Get out of here. And because I came prepared, thank you, Depths, I can just kind of tank this. And get all the rewards therein, yeah. Chest number one contains 
big battery. A battery with an improved compression rate. Though disposable, it holds many times as much energy as a normal one. Very useful. And I can include that in my auto builds. Okay, so that's... That's that. And we gotta make the best use of this. Oh, that's really weird. The fact that there's a maze above. Okay, I don't want to go in circles. Uh, let's... I'm technically now on a timer, which is really, really odd. There's that. We just went there. Yeah, let's drop down here. Have we gotten this before? Yes, we just got this. Ascend is gonna make this maze just to add a whole, a whole new element to it. Because before, if we wanted, we could climb to the top. Like, that was possible, but it would take us forever. And we might have to use a, a charge of Rivali's Gale to do so. Okay, so I do not want to pick up the acorns. Research log, day four. Okay, so I'm not, I'm doing this out of order. I can't believe I'm writing this, but I'm standing in front of ancient Zonai ruins. What a tremendous discovery. This makes the terror and uncertainty of getting here completely worth it. It's just a shame for me that I have no idea what these ruins are, but I'll head back and report to people who might. Did I just find the end? I found the end, maybe. Maybe, uh-oh. Uh, I have gloom resistance that I don't want to... I don't want to waste in here. So I found the end. Let's... Ooh. We can go further down. For you who have conquered this labyrinth of the land, I, the ruler of boars, have unlocked a door. Find it on the north side of the labyrinth in the sky. What? <laughs> what? Okay. All right. All right. That's cool. Let's go into the shrine now, I guess. Also, I don't know why I just went into the shrine after I said that whole thing about gloom resistance, but it'll pay off. I'm only going to waste a couple seconds here. Large zone I charge. Neat. And then we get, uh, we get Rarer's Blessing. Sweet. Is that open? No. I really want to go down there. Also, I don't know if I cheesed this shrine with the send or if there's a lot more to it, but I kind of skipped to the end on it. It's kind of weird. Uh, I. Wait, no, I could have just gone straight. That's odd. It was open from the start. That means there must be more to it, unless... You like my trick there? Yeah. Yeah, I got those. I got some tricks! I got some tricks. Don't let my death count fool you. I have... I've played Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom for many years of my life and know a lot of tricks. Okay, uh... I can't climb that really. Another encampment. It almost looks like if I were to have taken the, the nut trail, then it would have shown me everything. So if I do that, I'll see everything it has to offer. I've searched each passage one by one and haven't found anything, but I've got a good feeling about this last one. The only thing keeping me from exploring it right now is the late hour. I'll try to contain my excitement and get some sleep. Also, there are a lot of other games where uh, we'd find this guy's dead body. And he never found his way. Like, that's that's how Bethesda would have done it. It's not really how Nintendo rolls, but it would have been cool. It would have been cool to find this this guy's dead body. I kind of like that kind of storytelling. It makes you feel very special when it's like, oh, this guy actually just, like, failed. But I'm also, to a certain extent, I'm letting him rest? Huh. And he didn't think to look in the sand, huh? Like, you're you're letting him rest by fulfilling his last quest. Okay. Uh, I would like to drop that trash weapon. So here's my guess. I think how this is gonna go down 
is by completing the shrine above, we are going to get the opportunity to skydive from that sh that uh, maze. I said, think I said shrine. That maze down to the the bottom of this one through the opening we found. I think that's the the end game of this, which. I'm hoping I find a way to get up to said place from here. So otherwise, I don't really have a good idea outside of, like, going back to the Great Sky Island. Oh. Day three. No matter how far I go or which way I turn, everything looks the same. It's all covered in energy-sapping gloom. I've somehow managed to swallow my overwhelming desire to run home and will attempt to spend the night here. I just hope I have enough acorns to mark my way to the end. Okay, so we found every we found all of his notes because it ended on day four. And thanks to thanks to ascend, that's not very good. Thanks to ascend, I'm kind of able to speed run this. We're nearing the end of the shrine or end of the maze in Breath of the Wild. It's, the solution is somewhere around here. Because I don't think that room was the place in Breath of the Wild where it was solved. I could be misremembering it. Oh. Look at this. I mean, this is something. That's also something. One moment. I think we might have looted the entirety of the maze. But, can I, can I get back up to the sky maze from here? Let's find out. Up we go. I don't think we can. Maybe we can. Can we? Come on. Come on, go, go, go. Oh, we're so close. Let's at least get some architecture, see if we can see. There, there are those weird lamps everywhere. We're so close to it, but I don't, I don't think it's possible. Yeah, definitely, that's what's intended. We're supposed to get into this, and it'll open the gate below. So they said they opened a gate above, but somehow we have to get up there. I, how? Wait a minute. Am I dumb? I think I'm dumb. Watch this. Okay, we need to get on this. That's, this is the idea. We use it again. Does this work? Or does when it drop, I lose? No. It totally works. We can get up there. We can totally get up there. <laughs> Unless it... No, it, it, we can get up there. All I needed to do is use a little bit of ingenuity. Oh. Wait. Uh. Huh. No, but the idea is sound. It might work. Okay, well. If I have more zone, I, I can make a plane. And if I can make a plane, I think I can get up there from one of those stones. That's, uh... Wow. You know, I started out this session by saying I I was feeling ambitious. I was ready to do... I was ready to get stuff done. And I think I did. Even though I only got one shrine done, the amount of ruins we've gone into is impressive. And I think there's only one way we can celebrate. Obviously in the comments, because I, I know a couple of you have already said, hey, you should you should really go into the you should go into the, the depths. Or sorry, you should go into to the like sky maze. That should be like the last thing you do. Obviously. What? Why am 
Why is there a wheel here? That's odd. Oh, I see. Okay. Um, obviously, let me know how I do that. But, I think there are only two ways we can end off the session. A? I'm not gonna beat the- actually, you know what? On second thought- You again. On second thought, let's not beat the Gliok, because I have no food at all, and no arrows. Like, I have- I have six arrows. So let's maybe not do that. But- I do have my gear, so I can I can sit in on the the child Vo and you class. Let's do that. Oh, actually, before we do that, since we were the maze really wasn't all that I thought it was going to be. All, all thanks to Ascend. I'm not complaining. It just Ascend is really good. Uh, let's go here. I I intended to go here this recording session, and I just uh, frankly forgot. East Gruta ruins. Wow, how it's gotten a lot worse and if you recall this is where we found and used those orbs originally I would not be shocked we'll go in there in a second I would not be shocked if they were if they were here or if the last one is here remember we only need one more and it's the the two dot one let's find a place to go up because these are coded like those orbs. There's a ladder here. Very weird. Okay, I have a theory. Hear me out. The orb isn't on any of these. I think the orb was on this one. And it's tilted in the way it is to indicate that the orb is down here. I don't know how we get it out, but we're gonna find out. 